Good morning, friends. It's Sunday morning here in Virginia, and it's a very, very rainy day. All day we're supposed to get rain, but we really, really need it. But I appreciate you joining me this morning, and welcome if you're new. I'm Susan, and we're up in my craft room today. Um, we have been working on our kitchen cabinets, if you've seen my previous video, and we're finished, except that we haven't put the doors back on because my husband says they need to cure, I guess like a ham, I don't know. Um, so we'll probably put them on tomorrow and then I'll, I'll film the whole finished um, kitchen and I'll probably get that up Tuesday or Wednesday. So I'm sorry it's not today, but I thought I'd bring to you a haul that I have been accumulating from various places and we'll just sit and I'll share this. And this is probably the bulk of what I'm gonna buy, or I'm saying this, I hope it's true, um, for Christmas decor. I've gotta get out what I have and see what I have, but I don't really think I need much more. So let me share, let's get on with this haul and let me share. My first place I am gonna share from is good old TJ Maxx, you know that's my favorite store. So I was in there, I have been wanting a sign with this saying, it's the most wonderful time of the year. And I have a, a place I'm gonna put it and how I'm gonna work around it. So you'll see this coming up in my Christmas decor. And I have been looking, I've seen them in smaller signs. I've seen them differently, but this was the perfect size for what I needed. And it was $12.99. And I know you can go there and get them now because I was there yesterday and they still had them. And then I'm going to share a little Ray Dunn with you. I got lucky, you know, I, as I told you, I don't get there at the opening and beat the crowds or anything. What I get is what I get and that's it. So yesterday when I was there, I found eggnog and I had been wanting that. I want um, hot cocoa, but I probably won't find that. But I got eggnog. It was just sitting there all by its little lonesome. So I think somebody probably returned it or maybe somebody moved it from where it was supposed to be. I snatched this puppy up. So eggnog. And then one day I, came, I went in and there was a whole cart. What do they call those things? There's a name for those carts. I've heard girls call them, but I don't remember what they are. And I got some small salad size plates. And these are just going to be for my tablescape. I got two, three. I don't know why I didn't get four. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, two of the Mary. Ooh, if I don't break it. And one jingle. I've seen jingles, so I think I'll probably go ahead and pick another jingle up. I don't know what I was thinking. And then I found these cute little, let me take this off, these kind of round flat ornaments. These were $9.99. The plates were $4.99. I haven't even taken them out of the pack. I have some a pack of the you know the big hefty round ones that I got last year. They are really really heavy, and these are not quite as heavy. I think they're really cute. So we have Fala La Jingle and Cheer, and I know they have them in other. Um, with other words but these are all I'm gonna get and then while we were there I was there with my sister I'm hosting Thanksgiving here and she bought me these really cute turkey dessert plates are they the cutest things and then the matching napkins so I thought they were really cute just had to share they were each napkins were $2.99 and the plates were $3.99 I just thought they were really cute so I think that's all from TJ Maxx. Um, nope, nope, sitting right next to me. No, never mind. That's not TJ Maxx. <clears throat> Let me think. There is one more thing from TJ Maxx. Gotta find it. I know I shared those fabric trees, the Buffalo Chuck fabric trees. Well, I found this one. Oh, and it feels so. It's yarn just wrapped around a cone. It could easily make it on a um, pine little stump with a star at the top. It was $7.99, but of course, I'm gonna put this with my little snowman people. 
I just thought it was so cute. And it'll look so good with those, I don't have them over here, those little fabric trees that I got. So now I think that's all from TJ Maxx. And last weekend, let me fix my chair. Last weekend, my sister and I went to an estate sale in this old section of um, a city near me. And the lady had just gobs and gobs of figurines and glassware and, and things like that. Nothing, nothing really more than that. But you know, I started collecting these little Santa um, mugs. So I got these two. I think this is supposed to be a sugar. I don't know. This is a creamer, of course. This could have been just been a mug, but it was something she evidently made in ceramics because on the bottom it says um, 11, 1960, and it has her initials. So something she made, but still 1960, that's, that's 50 years ago. So I thought they were really cute. So I picked those up, and I believe these... The day we went, things were 30% off. So they probably were $5 or less. I'm not, because I don't, I took the tag off. I don't remember how much they were. And she also had um, a big, underneath this table was a Rubbermaid container of Christmas ornaments. So I started going through it. And I said to my sister, I said, look, there's Christopher Radko ornaments here. So we pulled all of them out. Um, my sister got right many, well, she got a few, um, and I got one. Isn't he cute? And he, after the, I think it was $8, and after the 30%, $540, $560, something like that. And he still has his little tag on him. So, I felt very fortunate to get him. And he'll look nice on my tree with all my other little radcos. So next, let's see. Let me move this out of the way before I break it. Um, let's do big lots. I saw Annie Cuckoo's video on big lots. I've seen some other ones too, but hers are always the best. So I went up to big lots. I've been there a month or so ago and bought some ribbon, but I went back and I purchased this pillow. Like I need another pillow, but I thought it was so pretty and I'll find somewhere to use it. I'm sure sometimes I like rotate my pillows out anyway, but, um, it was, it didn't have a price when I went to the checkout and the girl rung it up at $14. So I hope that's right. I think it was either 12 or 14. So anyway, I got that. And I got this little thing. I thought this would look cute on a tiered tray. This was $3 and they had it in red that said, ho, ho, ho. And I got the green just simply because I don't have that much green. So I thought it would be nice to have a little pop of green in there. And then I got these, um, they're little garlands. I thought I put a little tree in my kitchen, so I thought they would look really cute on the tree in the kitchen. I don't know how well you can see them. They're very lightweight, and they were two fifty a piece. Let's see what else. Did I get anything else from Big? Yeah, I did get something else from Big Lot. I almost forgot sitting right by me. I don't know if you, for those who've been with me for a while. You know, last year on my porch for Christmas, I had skates and I had my mother-in-law's old sled and kind of, you know, an outdoorsy feel like that. Well, Big Lots had these skis. Let's see, I'll get it in there. There we go. They're pretty good size. In fact, let's see. They're probably three feet at least. And they were uh, $25. But the day I went, they had 20% off. I forgot to mention that. So I got this, and I thought I could just beef up this bow, pretty it up a little bit, and stick it out 
on the front porch with my sled and my ice skates. It would make a nice addition. I'll probably get my husband to spray it with some of that clear spray to protect it. And I just see it's got a little boo-boo little there, but we can fix that. And let's see, I'm gonna next show you Walmart. Walmart is really slaying it this year. I mean, for the price, for the price. It, it, I've been there like three or four times. Every time I go, I, um, I just buy a few little things, you know, I'm grocery shopping and I slip it in the cart. So, you know, no one knows. Just kind of slip it in there with the groceries. So I did buy these um, trees, these little fake trees. And you know, they don't have prices on them. I think they were, I wanna say they were $4.99, but I really don't remember. And they've got snow on them. Well, let's see if you can see it. For the price, can't go wrong. So I got two of those. I may slip a few more in. Um, no, actually I got three of those. I have three sitting here, can't count. And then I love their signs. Their signs were precious. So I've got this, this was $7.98. Isn't that cute? And I have, I have these two buyer's choice carolers. The, the ladies holding a tray of peppermints and the boy or man, has got um, candy canes in his hand. And I thought this would go really cute with that. And I just like this one. I don't, I just thought it was just simply, so simple and pretty. And I was thinking they had another design. So I went back and if they do, I don't, I didn't see it. So maybe then I, maybe I imagined that it would be pretty if there was two of them. And this was also $7.98. And let's see. Um, I got some ribbon from, like I need more ribbon, but I really did. Got a couple things from Michaels. Got some stencils. We're gonna be doing a project in a couple weeks and I'm gonna be using these stencils and I'm gonna take you along on that little do it DIY. Um, I need to make some little gifts for neighbors. So I got these stencils. I did get some brushes, but I don't know. They're over there somewhere. And then I have to had a 50% off coupon and I couldn't stand wasting it. So I got some ribbon. And then, oh, while I was at, I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. It's early in the morning. While I was at Walmart, I got a whole tray of picks. Now their picks, most of them were 98 cents. A couple of them were a little bit more, like this one. This one was 3.98. And you know, it's got glitter on it. And you know, I don't like glitter, but it's Christmas and you gotta do a little glitter. And then this was 98 cents. I'm not gonna show you all of them. I'm just gonna kind of show you the different ones. Oops, drop one. Um, this one, this one's a really full one. And it was $5. But I was thinking, you know, I can use it to slide under the garland on my mantle or um, just in different areas around the house. So I just got a few here and there. I did get this at Michael's. This will go with our little DIY we're going to be working on. This was... $14, but I had a 50% off coupon and it was an additional, I got it last on um, Columbus Day and it was additional 20% off that day. Oops, there goes a tree. And there's a couple more things I got at Walmart. I got some garland. 
I bought this flocked garland last year and I really thought it was pretty, although it was messy as could be. But um, I'm gonna, I had my carolers in the garland that I got last year. So I'm gonna use this um, flocked garland for my snowman. And I don't remember. Y'all probably know how much it was because you go to Walmart as much as I do. But it was inexpensive. There, it is not lit, so I'll have to run some lights through it. And then last year on my front porch, I had a galvanized bucket with a really pretty arrangement of greenery and um, like styrofoam birch logs that were covered like in birch paper. Well, Walmart had these, I guess they're, they're real ones. They feel like real ones, they're heavy. So I got a, I got me some wood. I think they were $6 to put in my bucket. And I'll just tie a pretty ribbon around it and put that in my bucket. And everybody needs to buy some wood every now and then. And then the last thing, I think it's the last thing, Yes, it's the last thing. Um, I got this pretty um, mixed green garland. I think Liz also, Liz from Traditions for the Season also got this. I don't want to unwind it, but you can see how pretty it is. It's got cedar in it and pine and pine cones. It's not lit. I'll have to run some lights through it, but that's okay. But I thought that was really pretty. So I'm going to be using that on my mantle. And that does it, I think. Generally, I leave something out. If I did, I'll show you next time. I did want to show you, I when I was at Walmart, I, I bought a roll of this snowflake ribbon, which I thought was really pretty. And I have started making my bows. And this bow will go on my mantle. Um, and I've used, it's a 12 loop. And I've used three um, ribbons, like a velvet red, then the snowflake, oh, there it is, the snowflake ribbon, and then the this flannel buffalo check that I got from Big Lots, which I went back because I need I need to get another roll, and it did they did not have any at that store, so I'm gonna have to travel the roads to another Big Lots and see if I can find it. Um, but I think it turned out really pretty, so I'm going to have one at each end of my mantle on that garland. So that that's that. And I think that's all. Guess what, friends? I did leave something out from Walmart. A whole bag of goodies. I, I swear, if I had a brain, I'd be dangerous. It's too early in the morning, and I'm sorry if I'm sniffing a little bit. My sinuses are giving me a fit today but bag of goodies bag of goodies so you want to see you want to see him look at this little mitten isn't it cute this mitten was I don't know I want to say 2.98 not sure it's all fluffy. It's so soft. And then I got these curly curls uh, clips. Whoops. Curly clips. I got three of them. They're all tangled here. And I'm going to put this on the top of my tree that I have in my kitchen where I have my Ray Dunn. I have a little tree. So I'm just going to use this as the topper to the tree. And these were $1.49. Remember, groceries. Groceries we might not eat for a week, but we got Christmas decorations. And then I got these little tags. I'm not sure what I'll do with them. I may just put them on some gifts. I think these were 98 cents or $1.48 or something really cheap. I'll do something fun with them. And this is really what I wanted. And I had to go to two different Walmarts, two different times to get it. It's these galvanized star garland. It's 
six feet long. Let me see. I just thought it was really cute. And it's going to look so cute on what I plan to do with my mantle. And let's see. It was four, only $4.98. I cannot believe that that was only $4.98. They had them. I think they had trees, too. Trees. They had another uh, design. I think it was trees, but don't hold me to that. But I specifically wanted the stars, and I was delighted when I found it. And I, I was trying to do some galvanized ornaments for my tree that I'm putting in the kitchen. So I have this one. Oops. It's on both sides. Again, I don't know. A couple bucks, probably. This one, I think, is adorable. Even... This one. I'm sure they're all about the same price, but I don't remember. And I don't have my receipt in here. That would be cute on the tree in the kitchen, the little gingerbread boy. And the last one is a little stick tree in a galvanized bucket. So I believe that does complete the haul. I'm pretty sure that's it. So I appreciate you joining me this morning. And I hope you have a very good rest of your weekend. Good Sunday. Um, I should be back on Tuesday, May, at the latest Wednesday, with my cabinet paint job complete. And I have to tell you, I'm loving it so far. I get up in the morning, I go in the kitchen, I'll, wow, it's light and bright in here. So I cannot wait to share that with you. But until then, y'all be good and... I'll see you next time. Bye.